What's going on guys? Today I'm just going to give you a little bit of a review of my Stage 1 STI. Also, just letting you know how it's been owning the car for an entire year and if there's been any issues or not. So, keep watching. Yes. Alright. So as I said before, my STI right now is a stage one. The only thing I have done to it is a cob intake. And yeah, that's about it. I've had the tune for probably about, I would say, what do you think it was like? Six months. Yeah, but around six months, something like that. And there really haven't been any issues that I've had with it. I mean, I love the car. The, everything's been running right. So, I haven't really had any issues. So, I've owned the car for a year now, and honestly, I really can't complain. This car has lived up to every expectation I've had. And not to say that it's flawless or anything like that, but it's everything that I thought it would be when buying the car. So, very pleased with that. Alright, I'm about to do a little pull for you guys. Let you hear what it sounds like. stage one is just amazing this is probably the fastest car I've ever driven and I know yeah that's not saying too much but I mean it's a pretty good car especially with the all-wheel drive system it makes it feel a lot faster than you would think around 300 horsepower at the crank anyway would feel I want to also do a um, pro tune because I know a lot of people say Cobb's tunes especially stage two they're not really that safe so I definitely wanted to go ahead and do that just to make sure I don't break anything so that's something that will definitely be in the future as well I definitely want to get a downpipe hopefully I'll have that pretty soon also I want to do coils to improve the handling because if you don't know which some people may not or may doesn't matter but this car has a little bit of body roll a little bit more than it should I believe so definitely want to get the coils of course get some wheels probably do I think 18 by nine and a half or something like that sounds about right and that's really all I have planned for the short term anyway long term I'd like to build the motor up and upgrade the turbo I don't know what to yet but I'll figure it out eventually so when initially car shopping a year ago there are a bunch of different cars I was looking at. I was looking at the Mazda Speed 3, I was looking at the BRZ, even the Evo, but I went to, I think it was Manassas, Virginia, and then I just, I saw this car. And really, I wasn't even going to look at this car. My mom's the one who encouraged me to actually go and look at it. I didn't even expect to really anything to come out of it, but I went there, took me for a test drive, and I was hooked. Next thing you know, they tried to get me approved, and I got approved on the spot, so I was pretty happy about that. Although, I wanted to wait a little bit, so I ended up actually waiting a week to get it, and they tried to feed you the usual BS about, oh, someone's coming up to look at the car, it probably won't be here, or whatever. But I knew they were lying, and I came back a week later, brought the car, so that's the story. <laughs> well, guys, that's pretty much all I have for the video. If you notice the camera quality improvement, that's because we switched to a new camera. We're using the um, GH4 now, so 
definitely should be better quality. Of course, 60 frames is always good. And um, we'll be making a separate video about the new camera equipment. So be on the lookout for that. And yeah, have a nice day, everybody. Take care.